One of the most important things for us to do as early childhood educators is to find a way to make their early years learning framework meaningful and useful. And we can only do that by really personalizing it. So I just wanted to show you this amazing story that one of my students has created. Now, Alana, what she's done is she's drawn this beautiful picture. And you'll see when you really hone in, um, outcome one, children have a strong sense of identity. That's down in the roots. That's where the forest is all connected and where people know their place. Outcome two, children have a connection to their world. Again, this is the, the soil and this is the substance that connects all those roots together. And then outcome three, children have a strong sense of well-being. And she's put that up in, in the colours of the leaves. Again, you can tell whether a forest is healthy just by looking at the colours of the leaves. Outcome four is children are confident and involved learners. And again, what could be more appropriate than the trunk of a tree? A solid uh, growth, something that is confident and standing its place in a forest. And then outcome five, children are effective communicators. And that's all the flowers, all the different types of plants, and all of the things that make up this ecosystem. So what Alana did when she'd created this model is she said, well, how do we put this all back together? Because remembering, children are one person. They are not five different outcomes. Each child is unique and whole and perfect, just how they are. So she's gone and she's created these little babushka dolls that represent each of these elements. And she's put it here on her model. And I guess that's a really useful way for us to remind ourselves how we can use the framework to unpack a problem or to find a solution. But we must always remember to put it back together because we are working with one child. We are not working with different parts of that child. We are always working with a whole child as they present to us in that moment. I hope you enjoyed this. If you have other ideas of how you could make your early years learning framework personal and meaningful for you, I would love to hear them.